Francisco Goya, 1746-1828, was a Spanish Romantic painter and printer. He is often regarded as the most significant Spanish artist of the late 18th and early 19th century. In 1793, he was deafened by a serious and undetected illness and his art grew more darker and depressing as a result. These are some of his famous paintings. The 3rd of May 1808 The 3rd of May 1808, the most famous painting by the artist, depicts the retaliation by the French the following day, during which hundreds of Spaniards were rounded up and shot. Saturn Devouring His Son Saturn Devouring His Son illustrates the Greek tale of the Titan Cronus, who, fearful that one of his offspring might overthrow him, ate each of his children upon their birth. The piece is one of black paintings that Goya painted directly on the walls of his dwelling. Wait. May 1808 represents one of the numerous popular uprisings against France's conquest of Spain that ignited the Peninsular War. Attempts to detain members of the Spanish royal family in Madrid sparked a major uprising. Charles IV of Spain and his family This painting depicts Charles IV of Spain and his family in life-size, opulent clothing and jewels. Charles IV and his wife, Maria Luisa of Parma, are prominently shown in the artwork accompanied by their children and relations. The Colossus The Colossus depicts a giant in the middle of the canvas striding towards the left-hand side of the image. Mountains hide his legs up to his thighs, and clouds envelop his torso, the giant looks to be taking an aggressive stance, with one of his fists raised to shoulder height. Which is Sabbath, the Great He-Goat. The Great He-Goat were given to an oil mural that was painted between 1821 and 1823. It delves on issues such as violence, intimidation, aging, and death. In Moonlight Shadow, Satan hulks in the guise of a goat over a coven of fearful witches. It is one of black paintings that Goya painted in oil to the plaster walls of his home. Lost Disparance The Follies is a series of etching and aquatint prints made between 1815 and 1823, including retouching in dry point and engraving. The difficult-to-explain sequences feature gloomy, dreamlike scenarios that experts have linked to political difficulties, ancient proverbs, and the Spanish carnival. The Sleep of Reason Produces Monsters The Sleep of Reason Produces Monsters is an aquatint made between 1797 and 1799 for the Diario de Madrid. It is the 43rd of the 80 aquatints that comprise the satirical Los Caprichos series. Goya largely used the popular method of caricature in these series of etchings, which he embellished with aesthetic creativity. The Dog The dog is one of Goya's black paintings, which he created by painting directly on the walls of his home. It depicts a dog's head looking up. The dog is virtually lost in the immensity of the image, which is vacant save for a dark sloping region towards the bottom of the image, an unknown bulk that covers the animal's body. The Parasol The woman in this particular painting is sitting on the ground, possibly resting from a long walk. She is dressed in French style, according to the time period. She is holding a fan in her right hand, while a little dog is cuddled in her lap. The young man is holding the parasol in order to shade the woman's face. The Clothed Maja It is a clothed version of the earlier La Maja Desnuda. Saint Jerome in Penitence 